Alright, we're going on a pretty rough road. Rough in so far as a lot of turns and a lot of deer. So I, uh, I made my cousin go in front of me to keep me in line so I don't go too fast. But then again, he's flying. see a freaking thing. Jeez, man, I can't believe how fast he's going. There he is. Oh my goodness, it's even colder than it was before. This road is a lot of fun too. Uh, it's like a real far back road. Oh my god, I'm freezing. Holy crap. Jeans and a, and a textile uh, jacket do not really work well in 30 degree weather. This road is a lot of fun, like I was saying. Um, in the daytime, like when most people are at work, as fast as you want, a lot of turns on it, and uh, turn coming up right now is real bad. What I'm trying to do is take you on all the back roads, take you on all the scenic routes kind of thing. Um, I don't live in farm country, don't get me wrong, but um, you know, driving on the highway and everything, which a lot of people do, is not that fun. I mean, it's cool and everything. I used to watch uh, Shot Going Out all the time. Um, Shot Going Out is a little nuts. i uh, not saying anything bad about him. He helped me out a lot. With a couple of religious, religious topics. Uh, and I'm Catholic, and I, uh, I truly believe in God, and I believe that He is, uh, you know, He does exist, and He's my Lord and Savior. But uh, I'm not going to try to convert people. You know, I'll tell people about God and I'll give them uh, some knowledge, but I'm not going to kind of force it onto them. Because when I'm forced to do things, I don't do them. I say, yeah, screw you, not happening. Um, but anyway, that's besides the point. But he, he does a lot of highway riding uh, as a cop. And, um, and what he does on the highway is cool, but after a while it gets boring. The same thing over and over again. So I'm trying to take down a lot of back roads trying to take you to places that you probably don't normally see, uh, especially in New York, and, uh, you know, seeing some fun roads. Oh my god, I am cold. This camera lighting up my face, and uh, the, the way that it's dark out is uh, it's not really helping me out at all because it's like the difference light in my face and dark outside my helmet can't really see that well so if I go down I got it on film I told my parents that I was like they're like you know why are you why are you driving with a camera in your helmet that's so stupid and I'm like well think of the good thing you know if I if I go down and I fall or I kill myself you'll be able to see my you know what I was looking at right before I died and for some reason, my mom didn't really like that. <laughs> she was, uh, she was like, you're an idiot. You need to stop doing that. This video is probably going to be over 10 minutes. That's okay. Okay, let's see if you can hear this. Got those railroad tracks here. Almost biffed it. <clears throat> Just trying to get my tire uh, nice and warmed up. Oh, I almost went for that. Sometimes 
sometimes a cop sits up here on the left, but I don't think that's a cop. Could be. Nope. It's a truck. I like the way my bike sounds right now, but, uh... It's like I was talking about in a previous video. It's like the, the ones that don't sound really good, they're just like messed up. <laughs> That's kind of how mine is, except I think it sounds good, so I might leave it. My bike's really comfortable. I don't know if you can see, but uh, it's not really like a sport bike. It's not really like a cruiser, it's not really, you know, uncomfortable. It's a sport touring bike, they call it. These are the same train tracks we went over a couple, you know, a little while ago, but I think it's exactly a mile away or something like that. something I'm freaking I'm dying it is chilly you know what's pretty cool is languages um, I remember downshift 83 saying that uh, something about the festival how oh how did I not know this was going on and uh, he's like oh it's because I can't speak Italian <laughs> and I thought that was pretty funny because uh, I know Spanish I'm not fluent or anything I took it in high school I was pretty good in it but uh, I forgot a lot of stuff. But now that I'm in college, I have a couple friends that are German and they know how to speak German. One of my friends, uh, he's actually, he was born in Germany, lived there until he was like six, and then he came over here. But he can speak it, so I'm trying to make him teach me German because I think the more languages you know, the better. And plus, it's freaking awesome if you can speak German. I mean, a lot of the dog training I do, I say stuff in German. At least at my job, I'll give commands in German. Um, and I know a lot of other trainers that do that too, just to get the dog into a, like a different mindset. That when I speak German, you know it's training mode. When I speak German, you know you know I want this, I'm expecting this, blah blah blah. So it's pretty cool. Languages are cool. Let me let me know what what languages you guys speak, and uh, and we'll go. You know we'll, we'll talk about that. It's pretty cool. I'm gonna cut the video now. All right, BMS One K signing out.